Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. From what we have here, this follows when we have a times a, which is the same thing as a squared. That is the same thing multiplying follows. This and we have a raised to the power of x or squared equals to 36 from here. The next step here, this follows when we have a raised to the power m raised to the power n. Which is the same thing as a raised to the power mn. That is, this power multiplies and we have 8 raised to the power 2x equals to 36. The next step here, we take the log on both sides. That is, we have log 8 raised to the power 2x equals to log 36. The next step here, we apply the power law of logarithm when we have log m raised to power p the same thing as p log m as this here this becomes 2x log 8 equals to log 36 then we divide both side by log 8 divide this side by log 8 also divide this side by log 8, which implies here log 8 cancelled each other. Then we have 2x left, which is equal to log 36 over log 8. The next step here, we can express 36 as 4 times 9. That is, what we have becomes 2x equals to log. 4 times 9 over log 8. Then, yeah, this follows the law of logarithm. When we have log a times b, which is something as log a plus log b. That is, what we have becomes 2x equals to log 4 plus log 9 over log 8 then next step here we separate this into two fractions and we have 2x equals to log 4 over log 8 plus log 9 over log 8 the next step here, we can write 4 as 2 times 2, which is 2 squared. Also, 8 as 2 times 2 times 2, which is 2 cubed. And 9 as 3 times 3, which is 3 squared. And what we have becomes 2x equals to log 2 squared over log 2 cubed plus log 3 squared over log 2 cube. The next step here, we apply the power law of logarithm. 2 comes here, 3 comes here, also here, 2 comes here and 3 comes here. And we have 2x equals to 2 log 2 over 3 log 2 and plus. Here we have 2 log 3 over 3 log 2 which implies yeah log 2 cancel each other we have 2 over 3 left and we have 2x equals to 2 over 3 plus here also can be written as 2 over 3 multiplied by log 3 over log 2 that is from here we can apply change of base that is when we have log 3 log a over log b this can be expressed as log a to base b that is what we have here becomes 2x equals to 2 over 3 plus 2 over 3 log 3 base 2 then next step here we bring this together as one fraction that is we have 2x equals to SCM here that's 3 and we have 2 plus 
2 log 3 is 2, which implies here we can multiply both sides by 1 over 2. Multiply this by 1 over 2. So multiply this side by 1 over 2. That is here, 2 cancel each other. We have x left equals to 2 plus 2 log 3 with 2, then over 3 times 2 here of 6. Then the value of x here equals 2 plus 2 log 3 with 2 all over 6. Then let's check here if this satisfies this given problem. That is, we substitute the value of x here, which is x equals to 2 plus 2 log 3 with 2 all over 6. Then what we have becomes 8 raised to power 2 plus 2 log 3 base 2 all over 6 also times 8 raised to power 2 plus 2 log 3 base 2 all over 6 is it equals to 36 on this side? And here, this this same base multiplying follows and we have a raised to power m times also same power a raised to power m, which can be written as a raised to power m plus m, which is 2m. As this here we have it raised to power 2 times the power that is 2 plus 2 log 3 base 2 over 6. Then is it equals to 36 on this side? That is here. This power multiplies. You can say 2 year 1 and 2 year 3. And we are left with 8 raised to the power 2 plus 2 log 3 raised to all over 3. Is it equals to 36 on this side? And also here, we can write it as 2 raised to the power 3, which is raised to the power 2 plus 2 log. 3 base 2 all over 3 is equal to 36 on this side. Then this power multiplies as well. 3 here cancel each other. We have 2 raised to power 2 plus 2 log 3 base 2 is equal to 36 here. Then here we apply the law of indices. When we have a raised to power m plus n. The same thing as a raised to the power m times a raised to the power m. At this here we have 2 square times 2 raised to the power 2 log 3 with 2 is equal to 36 on this side. And 2 square here, that's 4. And times here, we reverse this 2 off from power log and we have 2 raised to the power log 3 square is 2 is equal to 36 on this side. That is, this becomes 4 times 2 raised to the power log 3 squared, that's 9 raised to 2, is equal to 36 on this side. Then, this follows when we have a raised to the power log b to base a, which is the same thing as b. And this is the same thing as 9. 4 times 9 is equal to 36 a. And of course, 4 times 9 here gives us 36. Which is equals to 36 on this side. We have the left hand side now equals to the right hand side, and therefore we conclude that x equals to 2 plus 2 log 3 plus 2 all over 6 satisfies this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell. Share this video, give a thumbs up, and put your comments. See you next class and bye for now.